The first thing we should notice about number one is that it's a whole passage question. This is not asking about a specific line. This is something we want to save until the end, whether we read the passage or not, so that way we can kind of get a sense of who the narrator is by answering all the other questions. So that's a very important strategy, is whether you read the passages or, like me, use the no reading strategy, we want to save whole passage questions for last. And that lets us absorb more information about the passage so that we are always answering these with as much information as possible. Now, as we do this, we are obviously going to pick up a sense of who the narrator is, but also there are certain questions that direct us to lines that really make it clear. So question number seven in particular, six and seven, kind of direct us to this area about um, Barnard and Ralford, whatever kind of name that is. And so when we read that, we get a really clear sense of who is talking here. There's a lot of talk about it being my little brother, who's in the class with Miss Spivey and talking about Barnard and all of that. So, okay, why would someone's little brother be in this class? Well, if it's one of Miss Spivey's former students who's also in the class, then obviously she knows this story. So it wouldn't make sense for it to be Miss Spivey's predecessor, the teacher who came before her, because why would she be in the class? It wouldn't make sense for it to be Miss Spivey herself, because it's always talking about Miss Spivey as some other person. And C, an anonymous member of the community, well, I mean, we don't necessarily get this person's name here, but it's a specific person in the community, and A is just a lot more accurate of an answer. So it's, it's better to just go with your gut on these. C is too weird, and A matches with what we're reading and just makes sense. So this is why it's okay that we save the whole passage questions for last. We gain more information as we do the other questions, and that makes these big picture questions much easier because we've learned more about the passage. Always save whole passage questions for last.